Kingston's Recreation Department provides an extended sailing program to town residents. PAC TV Community News went to Kingston's Town Landing to learn more. Want to fill it in? Yeah. Thank you. I run the day-to-day -day operations for the town sailing program, uh, which deals with uh, payroll, maintenance of the boats, uh, setting up schedules for the classes, schedules for the instructors, and uh, essentially just handling the motorboat is my biggest uh, responsibility, making sure that's running properly because it's our biggest safety tool. All right, on the motorboat. Uh, today is capsize day actually where the students uh, run through how to capsize their boats properly and how to properly recover from a capsized sailboat, uh, which is pretty essential because in the event that you do capsize your boat while you're underway sailing, uh, when you're not doing it on purpose, then uh, being able to right your sailboat uh, requires a lot of effort and a lot of time, especially on a larger sailboat, because uh, if you don't, then you'll require assistance from a search and rescue vessel such as a harbor master or the U.S. Coast Guard if necessary. Um, as they capsize, uh, the way that you're supposed to capsize is you turn your sail into what's called irons, which is the direction of the wind. And then after you sail into irons to prevent your boat from moving, uh, you pull on the mast of your sailboat uh, in the direction of the sail. Usually it's off to the left or to the right. And that will result in the capsize of your sailboat. At that point, you tend to jump off the sailboat and what you have to do is swim around to the back side of the sailboat, uh, the underside, which will now be upright, and uh, push down on the dagger board or center board, which helps keep the sailboat balanced. And by doing that, the sailboat will properly right itself. Uh, this technique's more common on smaller sailboats. Um, on larger sailboats, that technique won't quite work just due to the uh, mass and weight of the sailboat. This is our third week, which means that this is our Fourth class, um, we run classes level one and level two, as well as a high school class for older kids that uh, would like to learn how to sail and hopefully be able to put this program on a college transcript and make themselves look more applicable to a, uh, a university of their choice. 